Hello friends, in this problem, there is a region of space where electric field is given by the following expression. Now consider an imaginary cubical volume of side small a as shown with all the edges parallel to the axis of the coordinates that is x, y and z as shown. Now we have to find the total flux through surfaces 1 and 3 as well as the charge enclosed inside the cubical volume. So let us check out of all the four possible options which options are correct so let us start with phase number one that is the leftmost phase we are talking about this phase that is phase one so let us first make into take into consideration for phase one i can write the x coordinate of all the points lying on this phase is zero therefore the value of e will be e naught y j cap now this field is in y direction that is going to graze this surface so we can say that the net flux of this field through surface 1 is 0. Now let us move our focus or consideration to phase 3. For phase 3 we can say that the x coordinate is equal to a. So the field will be equal to e naught a i cap plus e naught y j cap. I have written this value from the expression of field already given to us in the problem. Now since flux on the phase 3 will be only due to x component of field as you can see this is phase 3 and flux passing through phase 3 will be due to the x component only the x component of field will be responsible for passing through flux or for creating the flux through phase 3. So we can write the flux passing through phase 3 will be equal to the x component of field that is e naught a multiplied by its area that is e naught a cube is the flux passing through 3. The net sum of flux passing through 1 plus 3 phi 1 plus phi 3 is e naught a cube which is actually given to us in the option a so option a is correct. Now let us talk about flux passing through phase 5 and 6. Phase 5 is the front phase and uh, phase 6 is the back phase as you can see the field is in x and y direction but there is no component of field in the z direction so this field is going to graze the front as well as the back phase so we can say that the flux passing through phase 5 and 6 is 0. Further analysis reveals to us that flux passing through phase 4 will also be 0 and it is the reason which is similar to The reason mentioned for finding flux in phase 1. So you can find the similar result over here. Now let us calculate the flux passing through phase 2. Phase 2 is the topmost phase and for this particular phase we know that the field will be equal to e naught x i cap plus e naught a j cap. Since the y coordinate of since the y coordinate of all the points lying on this phase 2 will be equal to a that's why I have written instead of y I have written a. Now we know that flux passing through phase 2 due to will be due to only y component as you can see that only y component of field will be responsible for generating flux through phase 2. So we can write flux through phase 2 will be equal to the y component of field multiplied by its area that is e naught a cube. Now we can add all this flux in order to find the net flux which comes out to be equal to 2 e naught a cube which is equal to q in by epsilon naught as per Gauss law. So from here we can write the value of q in will be equal to 2 epsilon naught e a cube and this matches with option b which is again our desired result. So the correct options will be a and b. Thank you.